Why does the B-52 bomber have wheels on its wings? In the 1950s, Boeing engineer George Scherer thought he'd built the perfect bomber. Fast, massive, and with these long, flexible wings. But during the very first test flight, something felt off. As the aircraft climbed, the wings began to bend, a lot. 17 feet at the tips, it looked like they were made of rubber. And then came the landing. As the plane touched down, the wingtips actually scraped the runway. Sparks flew, the pilot barely made it down alive. Scherer was panicking, the Air Force was furious. This $44 million prototype, now a flying hazard. But then, he had an idea. Let's put wheels on the wingtips. His team laughed. Wheels on wings, that's ridiculous. But on the next flight, those tiny outrigger wheels worked. They swiveled in crosswinds, balanced the wings, and made the B-52 one of the most stable bombers ever made. Turns out saving a jet that big might just come down to two tiny wheels. 